welcome back to Finding My Star. Today's video, we are going to tackle my closet. Summer is coming. It's not going to be cold anymore. So I'm going to go through my closet, get rid of things that don't fit me anymore because I've lost some weight. Get rid of things that I haven't worn or I don't like anymore. Um, and just really go through and mindfully see what um, what to keep and what to go. So this is the inside so far. Mind you, most of my clothes are actually <laughs> in my laundry hamper, but uh, let's go through this quickly. So Halloween costume that I've had forever is staying because I wear it every year. I don't own like super dressy clothes. I've worn this jacket once. I'd love to get rid of it, but if I ever need to wear a jacket, like a suit jacket, there we go. Move this over. This dress I've had forever. I shouldn't keep things just because, but I'm going to keep that one just because. These are dresses that I really like. This one, however, I don't like because it just doesn't. It's just not that great. Another dress, don't like it. It's going. Hoodie that I wear quite a bit. Another hoodie I wear quite a bit. And another hoodie. Um, I'm torn. Because I have three of like the exact same, well, pretty much the same. Two of the same hoodie, just different colors. I'm going to keep both of those for now. This is going, I've worn it like once this year. This, don't really like. <laughs> Let's be honest, it's itchy. It doesn't really keep me that warm. This, I absolutely hate. I've worn it maybe once. I, I can't stand it. This, I like. And it's going to stay. As is this. This makes me feel like a pumpkin and it's going. There's one pair of pants that I don't like the texture of and I think these these ones I don't like. These ones are going. Track pants. I like track pants. And both these jeans I don't think really fit me. I'm going to try them on quickly and we're going to see. So pair number one is a little bit tight, but I'm going to keep them because the pair I wear all the time is getting too big. So um, I'm probably going to end up getting rid of those probably by the end of summer and I'll be wearing these instead. So these are a keeper. Plus they are Pennington, slightly curvy fit, which always fits me better than most. But anyway. So these are a bigger size than I actually wear right now, but they don't fit. These are going. I don't like them. I don't like the look of them. Nope. Going. Okay. Back into the closet. So. Ooh. Uh, the hanger doesn't want to come out. It's like tangled in it. Anyway. One pair of capris. That's all the capris I own. It's staying. Taylor's got a toy. Um, this thing here. I like this a bit but I don't think I've worn it in like two years. So I think it's gonna go. True goodbye pile. Did you go to Ducky? What's the Ducky say? Go quack quack. Um, this robe I really love. I wore it when I had surgery and that's pretty much it. But I'm gonna keep it for right now. Um, and this is like my house coat thing. Um, I wear this in winter quite a bit when I don't want a long sleeve pajama top, but I'm too cold to have um, nothing. Do you squeak squeak? Can mama have it? No. We should clothing purge your stuff, although I don't think you have too much. Should we check and see? Let's purge your stuff. Oh, you have a lot of clothes. Wow, Mama should have gone through this stuff before. Okay, so let's see. We should try. We should try your dress on. Karen, let's try it on. 
Christmas dress can stay because it still fits you. <laughs> Even though you hate it. Yeah, let's take a look at the rest of the stuff. Anything with hoods just usually doesn't do very well with her. This looks way too big. That looks too big. Uh, can I... I, I want to go through it. You, and we, are we getting rid of that one? Where's your toy at? Where'd your toy go? You're driving me nuts now. Um, this has a hood, but it seems pretty warm. I might try that on her. Because usually she only wears sweaters um, when it's cold out. This I know is too big. Because I tried to put on her one day. It was way too big. And that's why I feel like this one's going to be too big too. Small dog problems. Things are just just too tiny. Yeah, that's going to be too big. So those are going to go away. She wore, she's worn this one quite a bit. Um, so I think I'm going to try that one on her. This one on her. This one on her. And this one on her. And let's see. She hates getting clothes on though, so this should be interesting. Um, not a fan of this one. It's not very long. It fits her, but I don't like hoods anymore. I find they're too much of a pain with her. Um, so we're going to take this one off. Yeah, help Mama. Mama's only got one hand. Oh. oh you got to get your head out. Pull your head out. There you go. Let's try the next one. That, nope, that one's going to go. <laughs> the hood is way too big and it's going to cause problems. Nope. So this one I like the length of. It's a bit longer. You might keep that one. I think we're going to keep that one. So this is one that she's usually worn. I like it because there's no actual arms. It's just holes. And the hood's not very big. Yeah. And it's pretty long. I think we're going to keep that one. This one. Your dress. And your raincoat. That's it. You happy to be done now? Mama's going to finish up her clothes now. Let's go. So I'm going to go through my hamper. And as I do... It's going to stay or it's going to go. Ugh. Let's get started. This is going to stay. Um, I wear it quite a bit in spring. This I absolutely hate. I It sat in my closet for forever and then I wore it this week. And it reminded me how much I hated it. Sweatpants. I live in them. Jamma bottoms. Also lived in. Socks and undies automatically are staying. This sweater thing here. Staying. Okay, let me go through this quickly. So here are the things that are staying. This, I don't care for this fabric a whole lot. I'm getting rid of the top because I don't like the fabric. But I, I only have one wear pair of pajama bottoms. These are it. And I've had them a very long time. So I'm gonna keep these for now and reevaluate another time. This is another thing I wasn't sure about. <sighs> my dad got me this when I had surgery because I needed nightgowns. My only complaint is really it gets dog hair all over it all the time. So I'm not... With summer coming though, that's my thing. Like, I'd rather wear a nightgown in summer than pajama bottoms. So I'm going gonna, gonna to hold on to it for summer, I think, and then reevaluate in the winter. Round two. This is when I feel like I have too much clothes and I can do better than just that measly pile. But anyway, let's go through it. So I have this purple shirt that I really like. Um, it's nice and breezy. It's light. I like the way it feels. Anyway, I almost always wear it with this purple sweater that I absolutely hate. <laughs> um, so instead, I'm like, okay, what can I wear with it? If I don't wear this purple sweater, if I put the purple sweater over there, what can I wear with it? And I'm like, you know what? I have um, a black, where to go? This black thing that I can wear with it. That's short sleeves. I have um, in here somewhere, I have a black sweater I can wear, like long sleeve sweater. Oh, there it is. Um, that I can wear with it. So I'm like, I do not need to keep the purple thing I hate to keep the purple shirt I love. And that's where I try to keep my clothing pretty simple, um, color-wise, because it's just easier. Yeah, let's keep going. I know I have some work clothes, logo clothes in here that I obviously don't want to be showing where I work. But anyway, no, you see my panties though. 
Um, this, this is a love-hate. I love it because it's long sleeves and it's blue so it matches lots. But uh, anything winter right now, I just, just don't want to deal with anything winter-wise. I have a lot of panties and socks. That I don't care about. This sweater, or this shirt I love. I wear it a lot. My students actually are like, teacher, you need new clothes. And I'm like, no, my clothes are fine. Anyway, let's keep going. I'm not quite done, but I'm going to show you. Um, I decided I'm getting rid of this because I don't, it's not often I need warm things. I'm going to get rid of this because I don't really like it. Decided I am going to get rid of this because um, I have like two other nightgowns plus a winter, uh, summer pajama set. Who needs more than three pajama sets for summer? Seriously. So anyway, so that's going. I found the other pants and I'm like, oh my gosh, which one was it that I don't like? I think it was these ones. So it was the material. Oh, I don't know. They feel like the same. <laughs> They're both Peddingtons. And but now I don't know which one it was. I might have to try them on and see which one it was. Out from the closet, I decided to get rid of the blue, uh, the green one because I have the blue one and I have the burgundy one. Don't need that many hoodies. Um, so I'm getting rid of the green one because I don't wear that one very often. It's like a backup, backup. I'm also getting rid of this thing. I tried it on and I don't like it at all. And I'm getting rid of one t-shirt because I have a lot of t-shirts and I don't need a t-shirt for every single day of the week. Um, kind of, sort of, but not really. Um, even in summer, I can do laundry. Um, so anyway, let's see what my closet looks like now. So I do have three dresses. Oh, four, oh I have five dresses. Five dresses. Um, that makes me sad. Um, I think winter, we'll see. When it comes winter, if I haven't worn them over summer, they're gone. Um, I have a thin, light hoodie. I have three normal hoodies, but one is actually a work hoodie. So... I got two. I have a black long sleeves cardigan, a blue long sleeve cardigan, and a teal thinner cardigan thingy. I have a short sleeve black cardigan, a short sleeve blue thingy. That's really short sleeve, so it's not really my favorite, but that's where this comes in. Um, blue and teal shirt that I love, uh, purple and black shirt that I love, black and red um, tank top blue and black tank top and a teal tank top. I have currently have two pairs of track pants, um, but one I'm going to cut and sew into capris, one pair of black dress pants, two pairs of jeans, one is pretty big on me, one is pretty small on me, so hopefully they will someday both fit well, or this one will obviously not fit well. This one will come out and this will be it. Um, I have a pair of capris, I have a robe, and I have like a little sweater thing for winter. 
and this shirt is my t-shirt. So I do have one t-shirt on plus a t-shirt that's in the dirty laundry hamper. So I have two other t-shirts, so that would get me through four days plus if I double up. Um, and then I have a bunch of just stupid t-shirts that are like once a year t-shirts because I work at a school and so we have orange shirt day and pink shirt day and anyway. So those are like my once a year shirts. I hate it. Um, but I refuse to buy a new shirt every year because some people do. And I'm like, why would you buy a new shirt? And then this is my pajama drawer. So I have two nightgowns. Um, one is long, one is like knee length. Um, a t-shirt shirt. I usually just wear a t-shirt and pajama bottoms. Um, but I do have like a short sleeve pajama top. I have a pair of shorts that are pajama shorts. And then pajama capris. <laughs> and then I have this pair of pajama bottoms that I've had forever. I have another pair that's in the laundry, and then I have the pair that I have on. And back there, I just have a bathing suit, bathing suit shorts, and a cover up. There we have it. Yay, we purged. Oh, I love it when I have room in my closet. Not to buy stuff, though. Like, just, I don't know. Just love it. Like I said, my students at work are like, you don't, you need more clothes, but they're so used to like the commercialism and the fast fashion and like you must have seven million things of clothes in order to be successful and I'm like, so like right there I have one, two, three, four, five, five outfits, just not including my dresses, so that's more than enough because I often wear two things a week, so um, like I'll wear, or maybe three things a week, but um, I usually double up on what I wear. Um, and then Fridays I wear jeans and a hoodie or jeans and a t-shirt with my school logo and stuff on it. So I really only need four outfits, so the pants I can easily wear every day. Um, I usually do laundry in the middle of the week anyway. Um, and then, like I said, I got four different stuff plus dresses. Um, so yeah. So there you go. There is my wardrobe purge or I'm, I'm gonna call it purge I don't know what else to call it <laughs> don't forget to subscribe for more minimalism, minimalism videos and intentional living thanks so much for watching let me know in the comments below do you go through your wardrobe in spring and fall as well um, that's when I usually do it in spring and winter um, getting through stuff that I haven't worn recently let me know do you do that too do you do it once a year do you never do it my mom Never does it. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I shall see you guys later. Bye, guys.